Hello everyone, this is Ben, AI6YR, and I just wanted to show off another very quick project that you can do if you want to improve your operating setup for uh, 12 volt uh, operation. And, uh, this is for me, for, for uh, my amateur radio uh, operation. I'd love to have a way to figure out what's going on with my batteries. And so, this is a, uh, a watt meter you can buy. These are um, about $12 off of eBay from China. And uh, let me pop this open, and you can see what it looks like inside. And these are uh, uh, these are they all have a, they have a load side and a source side, and a couple leads here. And uh, we're just going to put some power pole connectors on this, uh, pull off some wire, and I'll show you how these work. Um, you can basically see what uh, what kind of uh, power usage your equipment's having on 12 volts. So those of you who aren't familiar with power pole, Anderson power poles are these uh, connectors here. And they're standard that the uh, ACS Aries groups have, uh, have uh, decided on so that uh, you can basically go anywhere and plug in power and not have to worry about all the different uh, various power connectors. Uh, a few years ago I converted all of my equipment to that uh, to avoid cross, uh, cross connecting and shorting out equipment or reverse uh, polarity on stuff and it's been great. Um, so uh, on a connector, you'll see like this. That's that's kind of what you, you see. Um, so in order to do that, you've got to crimp these connectors on. This is the crimper. Uh, these are the the housings, and these are the actual uh, actual connectors to the the various wires. So uh, I'll go ahead and strip these and and crimp them and uh, uh, show you how this works. I've got these smaller connectors. I opened them up a little bit so my wire fits, and then I'm going to crimp them. So here's how you go ahead and crimp these. Um, stick them in here, stick them in the crimper, you crimp them, hopefully they go straight, and uh, crimped looks like something like that, and you insert them into the housing, and hopefully it'll slip in the housing, sometimes you have to push it in from the back with a screwdriver or something like that, they need to that in this case, and when they're, when they're uh, in they'll clip, but this one hasn't clipped yet, so I need to push that in, which I can't do on camera. Okay, so that's what it looks like when you've got it clipped in. And so I'll go ahead and do the black and then we'll plug it in and see how it works. So there's red and black. Now you just gotta put them in the right configuration. It turns out the right configuration is kinda like that. You slip them in. There's locking tabs that you can put on here, but I don't use them. And the other trick is getting them to clip together. That looked okay. Okay, so that, ooh, if I can get in focus here, sorry about that. That is what it's supposed to look like. So let's plug it into a battery and I'll see what reads. Okay, so here's a battery, and there's a load and source into these meters. Plug this in, and uh, you'll see the uh, power poles are matched to the standard for ACS Aries. And there is your watt meter, and I'll zoom in on that here. Apologize for the focus, I'm sure it's off. And that tells you it's 12.83 volts on this uh, battery, and zero watts. And we can put some, uh, let's put some load on this, and you'll see what it reads. So on this side of the wall here, I actually have some Christmas lights in this uh, in the shed here uh, on the end of this, and we'll put, plug it in and see how much that those Christmas lights draw. There's the uh, power poles. Yeah, 2.2 watts and 0.19 amps. So uh, anyway, you can see how this can be a useful tool, and you can figure out uh, what's going on. You can also see my battery is is really more than uh, around half full, 12.5 5 volts because um, it hasn't been charged up. But uh, these are a very useful tool to figure out uh, how much power you're drawing and how what your battery state is. Anyway, uh, this is Ben AI6YR, and uh, there you have another really simple project uh, and a, a tool to have around the shack.